Well, it's uh, 10 minutes to 2. I'm just getting ready to head for that gold diamond ring that was lost. I was supposed to have been there at 12 o'clock with Jimmy. But apparently Jimmy hadn't found it because he said if he found it, he'd text me and I wouldn't come. I've been at the damn Apple store since 11.30. I had up. Phone, I had some phone problems, so I had to upgrade to a new phone. I got an Apple Apple A phone. That took three days and a night. But anyway, I'm only ten minutes away. As soon as I find a place to park, I'll get back to you. I would have thought he found that ring right away. Because the lady lost two rings, I think I told you. Off one finger. And she actually found one of them herself. So the other one with the big diamond on it, should still be in the same spot. She said it was a big heavy gold ring. I wouldn't expect it to move a foot, an inch or two. I'll get back to you. Seaweed, this wouldn't get much colder. Yeah, I know it. No luck, huh? No. I can't believe that. I think, I think she said the first target's a 16. I don't think that's no fat gold ring. some sinkers and some nickels. Now I got a fine bottle cap. Fine bottle cap. You know that knocks like the bottle cap. Gray matter. Oh, it's a piece of old pipe or something. Solid 12. A nickel. Looks like an 82. We used today. But 12 out of the northeast. Solid 17, 16. Probably another bottle cap. Yep, bottle cap. I knew it was. I got the bottle cap down. Oh, I got some news to share with you. Grandson was with him. He's been here for three hours, at least two hours and a half. I think I told you that she lost them off the same finger at the same time. And she found one of them, but we were mistaken. There were some people down here metal detecting. And she asked them to look for it. And they found the first one. Not the diamond one. So I presume they came back or they found the other one and didn't tell her about it and kept it. She said it's really big diamond ring, worth thousands of dollars. Well, the jumpy's 11.7 right here. Now, see it? Just a waste of my time digging this baby. Oh, well, that sounds good.
was a bottle cap. Now I got a nice piece of three ounce gray matter. Well, this is a continuation of the hunt from Friday. I told you we thought the fellow who found the first ring found the second one, but that's not the case. But we didn't know that until yesterday, because he was back out here hunting yesterday, said he only found one. He had a Garrett Ace 150 or 250 or something like that. We know this value of 16,000 smackers on this ring. Don't know what it looks like, other than it's got a lot of diamonds in it. So I got the Mumbles man with me today. Low Tide Tim will be here in a minute, and FedEx Jimmy. I'll let you know how it goes. Just stop here. 12, 12. Twelve, twelve. That's not what I was expecting by any means from my old CTX. Now we got twelve, eleven. Look at that, another one. Damn, if I didn't know no better, I thought I had a knock with me. Nineteen forty seven maybe? Forty something wheat penny. Eight oh four. Now I don't know what that is. Oh eight oh four. Got a fourteen oh seven out of it with one scoop off the ground. Thirteen oh two. It's like copper. I got a wheat penny, forty some wheat penny. You got a wheat penny? There's Tim. Uh, I got a penny, a sinker, and some foil. I got a dime. I don't know how to talk. I got a piece of copper pipe too. Oh. Look at Tim. How you make out today? Zero again. No kidding. Yeah. I'm supposed to go back on Thursday. I'm going to have to call him and tell him I can't make it. I, I, I am going to call him and tell him. But we found, I found a dime and a wheat pen. We got four looters here now looting.
12, 12 out of the hole. Well, the one thing I can tell you, it's not a $16,000 ring. But I can tell you, it is half a pull tab. Not exactly what I had in mind for a 12-12 to be. But, sometimes, you know, we get fooled in this business. Like them two, three nice bottle caps I got. 15 feet away, we got a 12.15. It's got a little scratchy sound to it. I don't know that I'm excited now. Now that's a solid 12.15. This has got a lot of iron sound to it now. Might be a cap. It is a nice cap. A new one. Isn't that nice? That's just what I thought it was looking for. Coors. And more red ones. Red, red. Which one do you like the most? This one or the other one? Ha! And you stand it. Interference, I call it. You found your camera. No, I didn't find it yet. What is in your hand? This is my little GoPro camera. It's the big one I'm looking for. The big orange one. Well, I thought you were looking for that one. No, I knew where this one was. Big old jack. Circus train. You circus train. Yeah. Hi, Indian. Let's take a look at the figgies while we're out here. We ain't looked at the figs in about a week. Ain't been much change in them. Maybe a little bit. Oh, hush up. We ain't got to play ball right now. Hold, on, hold your pants on. Uh oh, look at that. Look at that. Look at that. That one will be ready by tomorrow the next day. That's the only damn one I see that's even remotely brown. They got to get bigger, fatter. But I'm going to have a banner crop. They're everywhere. Right, Bill Jack? I get them figs, they fall on the ground, I eat them. I don't know if I'm supposed to, but I eat them anyway. Me too. I eat them big, quiet. Be jealous. Hush. Hush your mouth up. Mmm, that's already finished. Some more in there going around and around, four minutes. Two minutes, 56 seconds. We may. We got a new kind of wine we're drinking. Where the hell did it go to? It's a funny, odd looking wine bottle. Forty ounces this. French. 
rosé. Not too bad. Do you have a napkin? No. I got you. Daddy, you need a napkin? I got one.